Gerke here from Worldwide Auctioneers and I am with our general manager Brian Sowers and beside us is two offerings that we will have at our Scottsdale auction later this month. Arguably two of the most iconic supercars from the 2000s as they've been chosen by celebrities, movie stars, and even by Bruce Wayne in the Dark Knight trilogies. The Lamborghini then, much more subtle. opportunity to see one of these a room is usually pretty awe-inspiring considering the production numbers of these right but to see both in what I would argue are pretty complimentary colors right uh, in the same room being offered together in Scottsdale presents a really fun opportunity for you and I to really get to dig into these cars chat about them experience them and kind of share what we've learned so both examples are exceptionally clean the Roadster is an automatic, and it is one of just 57 for the model year, whereas the yellow Murcielago is one of just 31 U.S. delivered examples with the coveted gated six-speed manual transmission. I think Brady and I have both had the opportunity over our time here at Worldwide to spend some time with Lamborghinis and even some earlier you know, the Countach, which the iconic poster that I had in my bedroom, uh, White Diablo in Scottsdale a couple years ago that we both got to interact with for a while, uh, the Murcielagos, Gallardos, and, and the Murcielago, in my opinion, is the one that took Lamborghini from the poster to the pavement. And I'm almost 6'2". Driving a Countach is almost impossible. Trying to back right. up a Countach, you swing the scissor door up and you hang halfway out the car to try to back it up. I mean, this car, and like we were talking about yesterday, it can be as well behaved as you want it to be as you're cruising around, and then it can just get real vicious uh, as you're going through the gated six speed if you wanted it to. So it, a thrilling car to drive, manageable, comfortable. Very uh, driver focused. Yeah, you can drive yeah. this thing a couple hundred miles and, and not feel bad about it and get out of the car still feeling okay. So the triple black roadster has just two owners from new clean carfax report it being one of just 57 roadsters with the triple black configuration it almost makes it a unicorn just like the 04 over here being a gated six speed factory sport exhaust two-tone interior uh, they're both exceptionally hard to find especially in the condition that they're in today that yeah, condition is really the probably the next thing we should talk about right so both have been well cared for, lived a pampered life. The gated six speed was the recipient of a dry ice uh, detailing service, T totaled almost five grand to get the undercarriage of this thing looking pristine. If you go to our website, you'll see we have a hundred undercarriage photos of this car there. You could flip it upside down and eat off of it. The Roadster is no different, right? I mean, right. so from paint to wheels to no abrasions on any of the rims, the interior, no rips. I mean, they are both just well, well cared for cars. And both have both been, have been serviced at Norwood Auto Italia out of Texas. So their maintenance is up to date and they are ready for the road for pure enjoyment right now. For sure. The only bad thing about them is you can't drive them both at the same, the same time. time. <laughs> so you're gonna have to rotate them. So these are both gonna be offered for sale at our Scottsdale sale. It is worth noting, the triple black 09 Roadster is offered without reserve. It means you should be able to take both home. We're gonna be out there Friday on a new day, January 26th. The auction will start at 11 a.m. Come visit us at worldwideauctioneers.com. Give us a call on the phone, get signed up to bid online, by the phone or in person, and don't miss an opportunity to collectively own a pair of Lambos that are less than 100 uh, in existence. Yep.